Hi guys, how's everyone doing? Kimmy here. Hope everyone's having a good day or good evening or good night. So, well, um, I just wanted to talk about the paranormal. I was wondering how many of y'all out there do believe in the paranormal. And how many of y'all had y'all's first experience with the paranormal. Um, for me, I was around 10 years old when I first experienced the uh, paranormal. Well, the house I'm in now is haunted. And uh, a lot of things happen in this house. Um, I'm not going to say a name or actually who it did uh, who did it because uh, uh, just for their safety um, that person had played with an Ouija board in this house and I had told them no don't play with it it's something you do not want to mess with and uh, that's what all things have started and so this person had started inviting stuff in and all that and and never closed the door so I don't know how to do that I'm not going to attempt to do that um, the things I've experienced in the house is uh, I've seen a hooded figure look like a grim reaper you can see a skeleton face and um See, I see a crawler. It crawls on his feet and hands. And it crawls on the ground, the walls, the ceiling. And that's not good. That's not a good spirit. It's a bad one. I see a lady in white. I've heard kids. Uh, I've seen a couple of male figures. And... Uh, uh, I've seen a headless man wearing overalls uh, outside. Well, a friend of mine was the one that saw him first and um, told me about it. And it scared the crap out of us when he had left. And uh, that's why I was getting my own place somewhere else because I was working in somewhere else. And I thought I'll move there where I could be able to get to work. And she came, that's when she came with me to get the couch and a few other things. She saw the exact same thing I saw. Freaked her out. And that's when she first saw the hood figure outside. Where the one where the overalls. She saw a little girl outside appear in front of the uh, playhouse. And, um, and there be times that you can hear her say, Mommy. Okay, and, uh, let me unplug the phone here. Now, I'll, I'll go ahead and go back there since there's still a little bit of light left. And, uh, and I'll, I'll explain a few things. And this, uh, this is the living room where I'm at. And it's considered like a safe room. And nothing bad hardly goes on in here. Um, the den, I was, there's a male figure that was set near the, the window over here. Uh, he's like overprotective on women. He will protect you. And sometimes he's a jokester, so um, he, he's cool. He he won't do nothing to you. In my bedroom, I'm not gonna show my bedroom at the moment. But uh, there's an attic, a way to the attic, only in the closet. And I've been hearing footsteps, uh, banging, whatever. It's freaky. And a friend of mine, well, he's me and him used to. Uh, dates and all that he went halfway up into the attic to take a few pictures and bring down so I could see what it looks like 
And when he was coming down, he felt something grab him, try to pull him back up, and he finally got down immediately. So, it, it scared him. So, uh, and I hear a lot of stuff uh, moving around. If you're hearing that noise, it's the heater. And in the back hallway over here, there'll be a, a, another male figure or two. They like to come up, like to spook you a little bit, but they don't do nothing to you. And this, I leave that up here so that way, you know, in case they want to mess with it. And same thing with the, the skeleton. The bathroom is mainly where I see the, the, uh, um, uh, um, the lady in white. And sometimes I'll see the, a crawler down here sometimes. And, uh, this is my old brother's bedroom. And the hood figure usually goes from this direction down that way. And he'll come back and forth at times. And... The light back here, right there, and here's the light switch. I could turn it on and off. Electricity does not work. The only thing that works is the outlet. And same thing with the bathroom light. Light switch is right here, and. I could turn it on. Nothing. The only thing that works is right up there is the heater. Does not work at all. This bed with electricity in here uh, does work in this room. And uh, this is my old room. And usually whenever I come back here, I knock. Coming in. I just want you want to be very plot whenever you do. Pumpkin. A kitty cat. Pumpkin spice. <laughs> Anybody wants her, please let me know. Okay, yes, this is my little room. Same thing. There's a light switch. The light does not turn on at all. Very occasionally, like maybe every three or four months, it'll work. I don't know why. And uh, in here, there's always been a lot of stuff going on. And uh, same thing. Closet light right there. And I could go like this, turn it on. Nothing. New light bulbs. Nothing. But anyway... In this room, you know, I had a lot of things happen. Scratches, bite marks, all that stuff. And, oh, pistachio. And, uh, it's my other kitty cat. And, um, I was picked up, kind of thrown down to the ground. I wasn't picked up too far. And, uh. I mean, I, I was always picked on. And, uh, after my mom moved, then that's when I moved my bedroom suit to the front room of the, or to the, her room in front of the house. So that way I could hear the door. And, uh, a little more safer. And, again, the, there's no electricity in here. I was here music and for like from a radio and as you can see the radio's right there it's not plugged up okay tv is right there at that corner and uh it's not plugged up because the outlets don't work back here. And, uh, and yes, you can hear like a TV or a 
a radio going. Oh, by the way, if you hear anything, well, I'm talk to y'all. Comment below, okay? But anyway, um, it, it, a lot of stuff always happens back here, okay? And pumpkin, no, ma'am. Stop it. Leave it alone. Sorry. She gets to everything. But anyway, um, a lot of stuff always happens back here a lot. And they mainly hang out back here most of the time. There'll be some of them that will go up to the den. And that's about it. They don't hardly go into the uh, living room. And it gets, I mean, it gets real tense. And I had a couple of EVPs on my recorder. And stupid me, I didn't transfer it to my laptop until it decided, until the recorder, or until the recorder, recorder decides to quit. So, I had some good EVPs. And, uh, I was like, oh, crap. Oh, well. And, um, uh, I would have posted on YouTube. Let y'all listen to them because I had some good ones. And some of them was, uh, you'll hear, get out. Leave. And it, it gets very, very tense. And, um. Uh, in my room that up in front of the house, there is a cross above my headboard. You know, at first I didn't notice it. But the second time I went back in my room, I looked up. The cross was not there. And I was like, okay, there's that's impossible. The cats cannot get it down. There's no way. And uh, so... I got to thank you for a second. So I was like, okay, where did it go? So I looked underneath the bed. It wasn't underneath the bed. Looked behind the headboard. Was not behind the headboard. So I pulled black, back the blanket. It was neatly laid in the middle of my bed. Chain neatly rolled up. I'm like, really? Seriously? You know, I, I, I was speechless. I'm like, uh, how in the living tarnation this happened? Pumpkin, leave the stuff alone. Pitiful. See? Mm. That's what she does. That's what she does. <coughs> Get to day everything. Anyway, um, well, another spot. I had it crossed back here. Hanging. Right there, there's a nail. Right there. And I came back here. The cross was on the floor. Tell me how weird that is. Very strange. So, but anyway, that's all I was going to tell, let you know what's going on. And yes, I'm going to do small videos. Thank you for exiting, exiting the room, pumpkin. Little turd. But anyway, I will do some small videos. Or if anything happens, I will come back here. And I would like for him to do some stuff. Trust me. I want proof of evidence. Showing. That they are here. Because I want the ones that do not believe in the paranormal. I want them to believe in the paranormal. 100%. I want them to know. What's here. And. Uh, uh, I do want. And I will. Do small videos. A certain things or what's go or what's going on and uh 
and I will post it and uh, let y'all think and stuff and tell me what's or tell me what y'all think and uh, so uh, that's probably all I can say that's probably all I can say at the moment and uh, so again I will try to post some more videos as soon as I can okay <coughs> so please subscribe please press like in your notification okay tell your friends all right so i hope everybody enjoy their day or evening or their night so i will get back to y'all later bye